Hey there. So we will start uh, to learn uh, final keyword in Java. Uh, why we need final keyword? Uh, what is the benefit of final keyword? Uh, why we use it? Uh, all this with uh, with some coding examples also we will see. So final can be used with fi uh, variable. Final can also be used with method and final can be used with classes. Final variable, uh, if we we'll use final with a variable, uh, it, it, it acts as a kind of uh, constant. Uh, it means uh, it, the values cannot be changed. Uh, if it is used with method, uh, it prevents method uh, from overriding. And if it is used with class, uh, it prevents in, uh, inheritance. Now, uh, in Java, when we use it uh, final with variable, uh, anyone cannot reassign the value to that variable. It acts as a constant. So, if a variable data type is immutable, for immutable types, the object state can be changed through the methods. It works uh, with for each loop. Uh, local final variables inside a method can be used. Uh, final class, we cannot extend a final class. Uh, it will throw a compiler error. Immutable classes should be marked as final. And fi with final method, uh, it cannot be overridden in a subclass. Uh, we can overload the function even if it is final, but cannot override it. Now in this example, uh, you can see uh, we have created a base class and the uh, base class is extended by a child class. Uh, there is a method of foo uh, which is declared in the base class. Uh, if we we'll try to overload that uh, in the uh, child class, uh, then it will throw the compiler error. So you cannot over override uh, a method if it is final in the uh, base class. Uh, so final keyword uh, in this example uh, coding sample example you can see uh, if it is used with variable uh, you cannot reassign it so here you can see uh, final int a uh, if we try to change the value of a it cannot be done uh, it will give you a compiler error uh, similarly if a, we have a class final class a uh, if class b try to extend class a that will give you a compiler error because final class cannot be extended and uh, in, case, in the third example, you can see uh, final method uh, cannot be overridden, uh, where in class A we have defined a, a function f and class B extends A. Uh, if we'll try, if class B try to over, override the method, it cannot be done, uh, it will throw the error. Uh, but over, uh, overloading is possible, uh, overriding is not possible in case of final. So the final uh, is a keyword, it's kind of modifier, uh, which can be used with class, method and uh, attribute variable. Uh, final class cannot have a children. Uh, final methods uh, cannot be overridden. And in case of variable attributes, uh, final attributes can uh, be assigned a value once in a lifetime. Uh, after that, it cannot be changed. You can see in this uh, sample how it can be done, uh, public final, uh, float pi uh, then public final double uh, in the case of method and in case of class just before the class keyword you can use you can use the final keyword uh, in this sample uh, coding sample you can see uh, I have declared uh, a variable a with final and assigned its value now at line number 11 if we will try to uh, assign or reassign some uh, new reassign a uh, with some new val uh, value uh, it will throw the compiler error. Uh, you can see here it cannot be uh, modified because it's a final variable. So today we learned uh, how to use the final keyword. Uh, so with uh, we can use the final keyword with class, variables and method. Um, when using with variable, it restricts changing the value of variable. If it is used with method, uh, it restricts method overriding. And if it is used uh, with, with the class, it restricts the inheritance. So that's all uh, from today's video for the final keyword. I hope uh, you guys understand uh, how to use and why to use and when and how to use uh, final keyword. Uh, if you have any question related to final keyword in Java, how to use, when to use uh, or for any issue, uh, you can write in the comment box. And if you think the videos are helpful, um, you can like and subscribe the video. Thank you so much for watching.